This video is about the structure of our report. The first one is the introduction of course. Next, we introduce the background information about this case, which is the history of HIH insurance. Then, we explain the accusation of FAI, including what was happening, who was involved, and so on. And also include the uh, that the dominant CEO and the lack of information should take the main responsibility for that failure. We believe that the most primary factor that indirectly caused the failure was the dominance of CEO. The lack of information was the leading factor that directly caused the failure. If the information they had uh, was adequate, and clear, there surely won't be such a decision. Let's move on to the next part of structure. We paid attention to the defects in the governance system. The board was believed to be most problematic, and the poor decision-making, unconcerned about the company strategies, and the lack of independence, and that led to an organization especially organization like HIH that has a highly dominant chef SQC. The external auditing and the internal control system are crucial as well. HIH had an unreliable external auditor and a chaotic internal control system, which also contribute to a capitalist of group. Finally, we list three remedies to prevent this kind of crisis. The first one is to balance the power of CEO with the board. The second is to improve the board accountability by implementing procedures like self-evaluation. And the last one is to be very careful to the process of decision making. And at the end is the conclusion. That's also we organized the, the group assessment. Thanks for your listening.